all right guys welcome to another episode today it is sprinkling all day but we are back at round two for common carp on corn we are doing four poles out again all with corn and we're trying to get some carp we're mainly doing this because it's something different something we don't do very often just something off the wall if I did it six times in a row I'd get tired of it but if I do it just a couple times a year it's pretty fun carp can be a lot of fun so that's what we're after just a simple rig a one ounce weight 35 pound Berkeley big game with dual hooks size 2 with three kernels of corn on each hook so it's like I really got out eight poles, doubling my chances. Alright guys, first fish. Oh, it's a big one. Oh, he's gonna cross my other pole. No, you're not. No, you're not. That's right. You're staying over here. Oh, now he's got me in the bush. No, you get over here, buddy. Around the bush. Around. Yeah. <laughs> Did you see my pole just bend out of nowhere? My gosh. Dip net, I guess. All right. All right, guys, first fish. Little guy, about four pounds, three pounds, but it's a start. Well guys, there's my fun evening, all the way through a whole inch and sticking out the okay, Alright guys, first fish of the day, about three pounds. Little, little guy, but still fun. Until this happened. Was Isn't that fun. fun. Oh yeah, lots of fun. It's not fun. Look, look. My second fish of the day, fishing with a hook in my finger. This guy bit before I even put my rod in the rod holder. It was that fast, wasn't it? I didn't even didn't even tighten the uh, slack line yet. No, I you. I cannot. Uh, well, I can't do both either. Put in your head. All right, guys, second fish of the day. This guy's a maybe a pound heavier. He's about four. <laughs> now he's about six, five or six, actually. Did you ever get the pliers out? Do you want them? This guy's a little bigger. He's about five or six. I want to say five. Yeah, he's six. Not bad. Yeah. Got that golden tail again. That's pretty. Yeah. Over. All right. But it's low. on her first fish you just got to get him completely around this tree that's all I can tell you you got him 
Oh, it's a nice one. Probably the biggest one of the day, isn't it? You you horsed him too much. You wasn't letting. You didn't have no drag. You you had it where he couldn't pull the line out. What did I tell you? Every time you fish and you never listen. I I could tell after you was reeling it in. I didn't hear him scream. The drag running out. You never learn your lesson. The fish have to be able to pull the line out, or they're gonna break it. So much for that fish. Now he's swimming around with a hook and weight in his mouth. They're just gonna get smarter and smarter every time we come because of that. There's no way he should have broke your line with 20 pound line if you had your drag set properly. Your thing should have been making some kind of screeching noise, at least, somewhat. You don't have to have it loose where you'll never get him, but you gotta have it in between. That's why you lost that fish 100%. Way to go. Oh man. Get pull it, pull it. All right, Wilma's on one, guys. That's a big one for sure. You want to get him here, but you don't want to cross my line. Nice yeah, I reeled mine in, so make sure you didn't. It's not bad, pretty small. Three pounder. Yeah, not really. Good Lord. You'll wear out. Good Lord. God. All right, guys, third carp of the day. Yeah. Alright guys, we caught three and missed one. And we missed the biggest one, of course. She had her drag all the way tight. Alright, good job. I'm going further away because you scared them right here for a while. Definitely scared them. farther away where they're not so spooked. Definitely ain't gonna catch nothing right in front of me anytime soon. <sighs> All right. All that for that, for that little guy. All right, guys, we got our fourth common carp. Looks like he swallowed the hook. No, he didn't. I don't get it either. Every time. <laughs> All right, guys, about another four pounder. All right. I'm so pretty. I like the color of this tail. 
Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs>